everyone welcome back to another tutorial my name is Cynthia if this is your first time here you're highly welcome so in this video we're going to be making a high loot top this is what we're going to be making today I'm using two yards of fabric for this tutorial so we go ahead and fold the fabric into two as you can see the one in the picture the front is low while the back is high I'll be making the front 25 inches and the back 42 or 43 inches. So I'll fold my fabric into two, it's 16 inches by length and this is just two yards. So I only cut out this from the two yards, I'll be using this for the neck facing. So I'll go ahead and turn it to the wrong side and fold my fabric into two. So this is the savage. I've already hemmed this side and the other side. So I'm going to measure this front part to see if it's up to 25 inches. This is 23 inches. So I'll measure it again. So I have uh, roughly 24 and a half inches. So this is fine. This is 24 and a half inches. So this is for the front side. So I folded it into two like so. This short one is for the front. It's for, I will measure the back to see if it's up to 44 inches. I have 43 and a half inches here. I think it's okay. After folding it into two like so, then I will take it and fold it again. So it's now folded into four. Since we have taken the length of the top, we'll go ahead and measure the shoulder and the neckline. The shoulder is 16 inches, divided by 2 is 8 inches. So first I will mark this 8 inches here. I'm going to be extending the shoulder. I will extend the shoulder, we add 4 inches to it. Instead of making it 8 inches, I'll make it 12 inches. So I'm adding 4 inches to it. So I'm taking four and a half inches for the wideness of the neck is a little bit wide. Four and a half inches, you can say five inches if you like. Then I will take two and a half inches for the neck depth. I'll connect it. I'm using the same neck depth for the front and back. This is the 12 inches for the shoulder. So I will go to the shoulder here and mark it one and a half inches for shoulder slope. Then I will take it. So I will take it all the way to this end here. From here I will take the armco measurement. The round armco is 16 inches divided by 2 is 8 inches. This is the end of the shoulder. Right from here I will take 8 inches. I will mark 8 inches. So that just it. I will go ahead and cut the neckline. So I'll make a notch here. This is where my shoulder ends. I will make a notch here also. This is the arm opening, that is the arm hole where the arms will go through. So I'll use this to cut out the neck facing. I'm cutting out two of these, the front and the back. I'll place this on the table. Then place this here. So 
wat sy zout. So I'll cut out two of these for the front and the back. I'll open it up. Now we use the facing to hem the neckline front and back, then turn it to the other side. After I've done that, I will sew it from here. This is the neckline. So it's up to this place. This is to show that the notch I made earlier. Then I will leave this place and sew. This is the arm opening. That is the arm hole. Then from here, I will start sewing it from here to this side again. Then this place, I will hem here. I will take half inch here and take half inch inside. I will take half inch on this side and take half inch again. I will hem this side here and hem this side. I will do the same thing to the other side. I will sew the shoulder, leave the arm hole, then sew the remaining part here, then hem the other side and the bottom of the dress. So for the arm opening, I'm still going to hem this place. I will take half inch and take half inch and sew the arm hole here. So guys, this is the outcome of the top. This is the neckline. This is the arm opening. And this is the other side I sew. So I sew the arm opening, I take half inch inside and sew the arm opening, that is the arm hole. And sew this side also. This place is left open. You can sew this side if you like, but I will leave it open. And I've also hemmed the edges. This is a simple and a quick top. It didn't take me up to 15 minutes to, to make it. This is the front part, and then this is the back. Here's the down side. So that's it for today. Thank you so much guys for watching. I'll see you in my next video. So please subscribe to my channel if this is your first time here. And don't forget to hit the notification bell. So you get to know each time I upload new video. I'll see you in my next one. Love you guys. Bye. Bye.